Hi guys, welcome back. I'll show you guys how to play Wires by The Neverhood. Uh, the song, if you talk about the studio version, it's not in the standard tuning. It's tuned a whole step down. And uh, well, basically, we have like open chords. If you basically go to the studio version. But in this video, I'll show you guys how to play the song, make it sound to the studio version without even tuning. And and doing any stuff just a minute just a second yeah so now everything is fine i'll show you guys the main riff we do have a change in chord progression for the chorus these are the chords which you need for the full song starting off with the g minor you take your index bar the entire third fret super hard so that no buzzing comes we don't want this we want this now your ring and pinky should be on the fifth fret of a and d Take the shape all the way up over here, barring the first fret. You got second fret on G with the middle finger, third fret on E and D, F major. So we got. Then we have this lovely little shape. It's a D major. It's mute, mute, open, second, third, second. And then we have this shape. Why not play like this? Why we need to play bar chord? Let's make it easy, right? I'll make things easy for you guys. This is an easy way of playing a E flat major chord. Take the D major shape, bring it one fret up, and there you have it. If you can, I would advise just put your pinky on D5. That really makes the chord sound so much better. And the last chord, it's a C minor. I'll bar the third fret, fourth fret on B, fifth fret on D and G. So it looks like this. Also, if you can, mute the top fret. Now, the song goes like this, uh, hold the G minor chord, hit the E string, hit the A string, hit the G string, so we got, now play 2nd fret on E string with the index, play 5th fret on E string with the pinky, play 4th fret on the D string using the ring finger. It's a way of playing a D major chord with F sharp on the bass. So we got. See that? So how nicely I put my fingers on the frets. Then you play E1, which is now F major chord. You go open D. Then you play D3. And the fourth time you do this, fourth line, it will be E1 again, open D. Then you play sixth fret on the D string and do a whole step bend. So, we want to get this note, so we'll kind of bend it down until we get that note. So, we got. If you want to bend up, that's all right. Bend down. Up to you. So, we got. Now, for the this was basically the verse. The chord progression was G minor, D major, F, and F. Now, for the chorus, it goes to G minor, F, E flat. You can play it like this or like this on C minor. So we got two down strokes down, down. flat C minor that's the whole song guys I hope the video helps you out let me know what other song you want to learn by the neighborhood and I'll see you guys back in the next video until then bye